Hello everyone, today I bring you an interesting BL drama my boy the series. First of all, the beginning of the story is very exciting. Before the editor could see the actor's face, the clothes of the two people in front of him had already been taken off. Adult games are always so exciting. I saw Andy nestled shyly in Vincent's arms. The two were chatting about some inappropriate compliments, such as you are awesome. Hearing this, one couldn't help but blush. At this time, Andy made a request to let Vincent only love himself, but Vincent's face changed when he heard about it. HH. It turned out that not long ago, Andy found her boyfriend cheating at home. Today's Vincent still thinks that physical cheating is not cheating, and thinks that Andy is making trouble for no reason. At this point, Andy couldn't take it anymore, and he made up his mind to move out of the house where he and his boyfriend lived together. At this moment, our hero Alex finally appeared. With his handsome appearance, he has become an eye-catching existence, and even a simple appearance can cause a lot of girls to scream. Suddenly, Alex's expression changed. Everyone was surprised and focused their attention on Andy who just sat down. It turned out that Andy took Alex's exclusive seat. Alex was dissatisfied, so he walked over to question him, but Andy didn't say anything, just looked up at him. This one glance managed to silence Alex. Fortunately, Alex's friend stopped Alex with bubble tea with only nine pearls. This strange habit is not good for friends to complain about, but Alex just doesn't change it. Afterwards, he picked up the guitar and prepared to play for everyone, which indeed attracted a large number of girls screaming, but Alex kept staring at Andy, wondering what he was thinking. On the other side, a red car drove into the school and senior Gwen got out of the car. The friend who was waiting for him on the other side complained impatiently, but the senior sister didn't tolerate them, so she just turned back. So, the three of them finally calmed down and walked towards the teaching building, but at this time, a handsome and lovely boy Ryan ran into a group of three people. Chico's children can always be easily forgiven and capture the hearts of girls. When one of the three girls teased Ryan, unexpectedly, Ryan startled everyone when he opened his mouth. On the other hand, Andy also recalled the meeting with Alex today and felt that the other party was very rude. At this time, Andy's friend came and asked Andy to help review statistics. Unexpectedly, Ryan is also Andy's friend. At the same time, he is also complaining to his friends about being favored by his kind. At the same time, Alex is playing the guitar at the entrance of the teaching building. Two beautiful girls came to him, but Alex kept his eyes on the girl named Alice. Alex didn't speak politely until the girl next to him, Cookie, made a sound. After the greetings were over and the two girls left, Alex didn't take his eyes off Alice. The friend couldn't help asking Alex if he liked Alice, and Alex admitted indirectly, Alice very much, but Alex thinks he likes cookies and asks the friend to match her up. The picture is shown at the entrance of the photography club and everyone is learning about the content of this club. Faye and Amelia were no surprise either. Senior Peter remained. Faye and Amelia still did not leave. The lovely Amelia attracted Peter's attention, and the senior asked Faye by the way. Peter thought the two were friends, but he didn't expect that they had nothing to do with each other. Faye is a girl with a very strong southern accent and a little stammer. No matter how Peter and Amelia corrected it, they couldn't correct it. But as long as it comes to diss and hate people, Faye is very fast. <laughs> Even so, Peter has always been gentle, which is really impressive. Eventually, both joined the photography club as well. Finally came the meeting ceremony of the photography club, and it turned out that Alex is the president. Ryan also joined the club and is very interested in handsome guys. Of course, other boys are also full of interest in the beautiful seniors in the club. Just when everyone was getting to know each other, Alex saw Andy sitting in the back. So, he remembered again the unpleasant first meeting between the two. In other words, Alex asked the seniors and sisters to introduce himself enthusiastically, and the juniors and sisters were also very supportive. Ryan yelled even more, wanting Alex's phone number. Faced with this kind of clingy person, of course Alex handed him over to senior sister Gwen and the teacher's self-introduction session that came later was even more outrageous. The teacher introduced himself briefly, as simple as only one name. In the following self-introduction session for new members, 
Alex set his sights on Andy. Andy had no choice but to introduce his name, and Alex really didn't miss this good opportunity and taunted him. Peter stepped forward at the critical moment and eased the atmosphere, which allowed the introduction to continue. So, next, all the younger students also introduced themselves. The tradition of the club is that a senior leads a newcomer to form one-on-one -on -one care. So, after self-introduction, everyone began to draw lots to find their own matching seniors. This is the joy of several families and the sorrow of others. Some people have found their favorite seniors and sisters, and some people's expectations have failed, and the key male protagonists must be paired up. Sure enough, Andy and Alex are one-on-one -on -one care objects. Looking at Andy's face, Alex always felt that this person was not young, so he asked directly, and Andy didn't hide it, telling everyone that he had already read his junior year in this school, and then dropped out. When asked why he dropped out, Andy refused to say, which made Alex very angry. Alex was about to rush up to beat Andy. Everyone was surprised and took out their mobile phones to take pictures. Fortunately, the friends around him stopped him so that the matter did not continue to develop. But after the meeting was over, Alex didn't calm down and kept complaining to his friends irritably. But my friends couldn't understand Alex's thoughts and thought he was a little funny until Alex mentioned that Andy took his exclusive seat in the morning. The friends laughed even harder. It's really naive for such a big child to be angry because of grabbing a seat. Friends even joked about giving Alex a chair to put on him every day. And Alex doesn't seem to be purely because of this incident. Because as long as he sees Andy's face, he can't like it. Just when Alex was full of anger and had nowhere to express, a phone call came. Alex immediately became gentle, talked to the other party in a soft voice, and agreed to meet each other. Is very different from the Alex who complained to his friends just now. Could it be Alice? On the other side, senior sister Gwen met her best friend at the bar together. But the senior sister didn't seem very happy and wanted to live with her best friend. But my best friend's house is either inconvenient or too small to entertain her at all. So Gwen had to reveal that she was spoiled by her family. Girlfriends are mad as hell, but dancing is better than being mad. So senior Gwen asked her girlfriends to dance together. At this moment, the senior sister accidentally bumped into the boy behind her. Turning around, he turned out to be a junior from his photography agency. Well-behaved junior quickly integrated into the seniors, and Ryan and other children also came over. Everyone praised the senior sister so elated. She clamored for a treat. At this time, the senior sister found that there seemed to be one person missing. It turned out that Andy didn't join the dance because of his age, but sat aside. Andy, who was not dancing, met Alex at the bathroom door. Alex didn't miss the opportunity to mock Andy and there was a sense of deliberate provocation in his words. Andy, although he looks gentle, speaks very tough, and directly retorts. What's even more funny is that Alex didn't hear it and was still thanking Andy. It wasn't until the other party walked away that Alex understood, secretly annoyed that it was too late for him to curse back. As for the senior sister, she was still dancing at this time. Alex sits and drinks. At this time, Alice and Cookie also suddenly appeared in the bar. In order to surprise Alex, and Alex's eyes are still on Alice this time, it wasn't until Cookie mentioned Alex that Alex politely invited everyone to dance together. Cookie said that she can't dance, but the next second she quickly reversed, and she took off her shoes, jumped onto the stage, and danced wildly. This scene frightened a group of people, and even made Alice call out. This is not her friend, although the surrounding area was very noisy and noisy. The scene where Alice was about to fall on top of Alex when he lost his footing was still very slow. The atmosphere was so subtle. Just when everyone thought that something would happen to Alex and Alice, Alex was actually taking care of Ryan at night. Ryan has been coveting Alex for a long time and is planning how to take him down. And our Alex didn't even refuse. In other words, Alex sent Ryan back to the room. But Ryan had been coveting Alex for a long time, so he wanted to stick together with him. But unexpectedly, Alex did not refuse and took the initiative. This is what Ryan dreamed of. How could he refuse? Seeing Alex's face getting closer and closer to Ryan, the daydream suddenly shattered. It turned out that this was Ryan's imagination and a little bit of memory. Ryan was very excited and felt that he had become a senior. At this time, 
Friends around him reminded Ryan that it was Ryan who was going to kiss last night, and Alex beat him up, and the one who took care of Ryan was this friend beside him. It was really embarrassing and embarrassing to drink. On the other hand, what flashed through Alice's mind was also the memory of Alex. That unexpected hug made her laugh out loud. And then Cookie discovered her mood. After seeing her friend's situation, Cookie understood her thoughts. Therefore, Cookie encouraged Alice to pursue boldly, but at the same time worried that Alex was too popular and that her friends would not be able to control Alex. But these are not the most important. The most important thing is to understand Alice's thoughts. In fact, Alice also thought about confessing to Alex, but she was not sure about the other party's intention. Cookie understood at a glance, and she said with certainty that from her own point of view, Alex has a crush on Alice. Alice is a little confused. So what should she do in this situation? Cookie thought for a while, and asked Alice to tell Alex directly, which is the best way. On the other side, Andy walked out of the classroom with his classmates. The classmates were noisy discussing the lessons they didn't understand, but fortunately Andy understood, so he promised to explain to you. At this time, Amelia's father picked her up. Andy didn't have dinner with his friends, so he left early and came to the office to find the teacher. It turned out that Andy was helping the teacher translate documents in his spare time. When the teacher saw Andy, he couldn't help but want to tease him. After all, the age difference between the two was not very big, but Andy doesn't think so. After all, he just looks older, but there is also an age difference between the two of them. Andy came directly to the library after dealing with the teacher, because in the library, there are several juniors waiting to be tutored by him. But when he arrived, the juniors were still playing and playing. Seeing this scene, he couldn't help but get a little angry, which made the juniors quiet down. But they began to worry about whether they would pass the exam and how Andy's tutoring ability was. Andy didn't want to mention it, but after thinking about it, he told everyone that he had read the content of the exam 100 times and passed the exam. It was only because of some reasons that he took a break from school for a while. Could it be because of the ex-boyfriend at the beginning? On the other side at this time, Alex was being invited by the school girl to go to the bar. Alex not only agreed to go with the school girl, but also released his own charm on the other person. At this time, senior sister Gwen felt a little emotional on the side. But how could Alex make the girls around him depressed? So, he turned his head and went to coax the senior sister. I have to say that the handsome face and considerate care are really useful. Senior Gwen soon stopped being angry, and Alex left the milk tea shop first on the pretext of buying her milk tea. The sisters couldn't resist the handsome Alex. Looking at that face even forgot about him. Just when Alex finished shopping and was about to leave, Andy also appeared at the milk tea shop and ordered the same drink as Alex. For some reason, when the two met, they disliked each other. Alex wants to pay Andy, but Andy doesn't agree. According to this situation, when will the relationship between the two people develop? On the other side, senior sister Gwen and Ying are talking, discussing whether they are handsome or not. Next, Alex walked up to the two of them, then Ying became excited in an instant. Such a handsome junior really meets his standards. Then Ying signed a contract with Alex. Is this a filming contract? Sure enough, Ying came to Alex to shoot commercials, and Ying was very satisfied with his appearance. At this time, Sister Chen, the owner of the product, also came to visit the filming work, and she was also very interested in Alex, but she clearly asked for two models, why only one? Ying Ying quickly explained that the other one is being prepared, but the difference is that the other one feels old and handsome, depending on the situation, it should be Andy's type. Alex looked up and it turned out to be Andy, which frightened Alex and embarrassed Andy, however, the two didn't say anything, and started to shoot together. Ying Ying and Sister Chen, who were watching at the same time, looked at this scene and were obsessed with their CP feeling. Therefore, the two proposed to set the next group of shooting as a couple photo mode. When Alex and Andy heard the news, they quickly stood up and objected, but the objection was invalid. In the next scene, the two had to act as a couple, and their actions became more and more intimate and Ying Ying and Sister Chen also showed meaningful smiles beside them. After the filming, Alex and Andy sat together after a long absence, and they had a meal in peace. But this was just the beginning. 
Alex curiously asked Andy why he had so many part-time jobs, and Andy was helpless. Alex was his partner today, he would have rejected him earlier. Faced with Alex's inquiries about hobbies and money, Andy was very angry and reprimanded Alex for not understanding the trouble of having no money. <laughs> this scene frightened Alex so much that when he was buying milk tea, he still thought of Andy's face of a money fanatic. Alex ordered his usual green tea with less sugar, the store manager's sister couldn't help sighing after seeing it. Boys nowadays really know how to protect their bodies. Alex is very curious. Who else has such a point? The store manager's sister pointed her finger. Whoa, isn't that Andy? Just at this time, Andy's drink was ready, and Alex offered to help take it. Just as Alex approached slowly, he heard Andy calling. It turned out that Andy's father was addicted to drinking and only asked his son for money every day. Andy not only has to pay the rent and tuition by himself, but also needs to make money for his father. Such a heavy pressure made him unable to breathe. Hanging up the phone, Andy looked up and saw Alex. Just when he thought the boy opposite was going to mock him, Alex sat down calmly and comforted Andy. Alex told Andy that if you have to talk to others, your troubles will be reduced. But Andy is worried that others will not like to hear negative energy. At this time, Alex stood up and said that he was willing to listen. And, whether Andy said it or not, Alex himself confides first. He said that there used to be two girls who fought for his handsomeness. Alex is very troubled. He is too handsome. Andy heard that Alex was so narcissistic, he still couldn't help laughing. When Alex saw Andy smile, his goal was achieved. After all, in Alex's eyes, Andy still looks very good looking when he smiles. Andy was also affected by the much more relaxed atmosphere, told his own story, and confessed his sadness. It turned out that he dropped out of school not because of his ex boyfriend, but because of his father who didn't work. Alex heard that Andy was able to support himself. He was so powerful, and he felt admiration spontaneously. The relationship between the two took another step, and Andy finally stopped being serious and chatted with Alex. Although Alex's words are very unpleasant, he is also very cute. Senior sister Gwen and senior Peter were leading everyone to chat, and Alice came over at this time. It turned out that she came to find Alex. Alex promised to come and teach her to take pictures today, but so far, she hasn't seen Alex's shadow yet. As soon as senior Gwen saw Alice, she started spreading rumors. Alex went out to play with other girls. Fortunately, Peter stopped by. The senior sister suggested that Peter should teach Alice photography, but Alice refused. But Peter was a little disappointed when he heard this, so he had to excuse himself to go to the bathroom and avoid everyone first. But when Peter came out of the bathroom, unexpectedly, he was stopped by Faye and Amelia. Amelia took out the chocolate she prepared to give to Peter. Peter was very surprised, but he accepted it anyway. Next, Amelia wanted to borrow her senior's mobile phone to make a call. So Faye had to speak, and she could borrow the mobile phone from herself. But Amelia turned a deaf ear, picked up the senior's mobile phone, and dialed her own number. Sure enough, this is all Amelia's trick. The purpose is to get the senior's phone number. On the other side, Alex, who didn't go to take pictures with Alice, ran into Andy on the road. Andy returned to his cold attitude, and emphasized that the two were not familiar with each other. But Alex didn't care at all. He said he was not familiar with it, so he gradually became familiar. So, he picked up Andy's mobile phone, added his social account, and expressed that he was willing to be an emotional trash can, and asked Andy to call himself a star. I have to say, young man, there is a future. Although Andy didn't express it at the time, when he got home that night, Alex's words kept replaying in his mind. At this time, Alex was being questioned by Peter questioning his feelings for Alice, and why Alex did not fulfill the agreement with Alice today. All right, that's all for this issue. Alex and Andy's relationship has eased, but it will be a while before they become friends. The beautiful Alice fell in love with Alex, but was destined to be let down by him, and Peter seems to have a good impression of Alice, but he doesn't know that there are also people who like him silently. The feelings of boys and girls are changing and sprouting quietly. What interesting stories will happen to them in the next issue?